Hello everyone, it's me again, GW fan the Softcore Brony, welcome you back to Let's Play Emerald Dragon. Took a little longer to get back to this than I would have liked, but well the holidays bring various time consuming stuff, so you know, what are you gonna do? Anyway, Petrucian's still gonna protect Tamron, who is still fairly useless outside of healing, but well, she's a little bit more useful now, but... Anyway, final dungeon awaits! Uh, immediately after we collect more ultimate equipment, including the Saji Cutter, I think it would, how it would be pronounced. Anyway, this is the other ultimate weapon for Varna, if you did not get the Bunny Rod, or just absolutely cannot get the Bunny Rod, no matter how hard you try. This is very unique because it's long range, meaning she can be safely in the back, and also, well, because of the agility of 40 there, which, uh, in my opinion, if you, you know, give her this and the bunny robe, which increases her agility by another 25, you can have her be a nice healer, since, uh, which is also a bit more imperative if you decide to put her in the back, <laughs> since, you know, Hoffman and Attrution will be taking most of the damage up front, <laughs> but... Well, I didn't find it necessary, even though I would give the permanent stat boosting items, uh, or distribute them a little differently if I did use this. Uh, I wouldn't give Barna any of them other than the points boost. Uh, I'd probably give the attack, uh, defense, and HP to Hothram in that case, especially since Attrition's just gonna get, uh, so many more points anyway. But yeah, I'm not gonna end up using the Saji Cutter. It's actually much weaker in damage because of the point cost. We have, uh, well, new enemies around here, obviously, Final Dungeon and all, but, well, they're not particularly threatening, oddly, especially with Barna and the Bunny Rod around. It's, Final Dungeon's kind of disappointing, honestly. The enemies are not that dangerous altogether. See, I didn't even have to do anything. <laughs> not to mention it's surprisingly straightforward. Here we get the, uh, all the Althena. I've been watching too much Lunar, dude. Athena's wand. <laughs> the ultimate weapon for Tamron. Has no attack power whatsoever. Not that she'd need it, anyway. But, where did it go? It, uh, has a points of 15 and agility plus 15 as well, which is nice. And intelligence of 50. Don't care about the use. But, yeah, uh, increasing her points. What's it, like? like seven more than what she already has, or something like that, from what the other... Or no, 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 equip, equip. Not that it really makes that big of a difference for her, ultimately, just because, well, you know, she just uses spells so stupidly randomly. Oh, wow. <laughs> she already has 22 natural... She maxes out at 23 points altogether. <laughs> Very soon, in fact, so... Attrition also, he uh, maxes out at 40 points, which he won't hit for quite a while. Uh, you know, once you get to, like, max level 100 and all that, but uh, I think he actually hits max points before that. Oh yeah, Tamra never gets beyond 100 agil natural agility either, even at max level, so she's never faster than anyone, stupidly, but... Well, this makes her a little bit more useful, I guess. No, there's not even any new enemies in here. <laughs> Not that it really matters. Wow, that guy's got a lot more HP than I thought. Hmm. Yeah, enemies around here, very disappointing. Are there any other new enemies around here? I'm not even sure. This, the enemies around here are just so pathetic. And here we get uh, the huge hat, the ultimate helmet for Sociant there. Not that it's really that big of a deal, since he's already in the back anyway. It's just, I believe, uh, offense, or offense, defense of 100. Yeah, compared to the 20 that he got with his wind hat there, so what do you freaking do? Huge hat. There you go, Sushiant. Be happy. Six enemies in that last battle, and Farna took out all but one of them. <laughs> Here we get another useless 100 Paris for some stupid reason. What the heck, game? Wow, we actually got back around to Farna's turn this time. I actually got to do something! Alright! Oh! There's a new enemy. Another vampire dude. Lots of HP, but... 
well, not as much as the other one for some reason. Or maybe we're just so much stronger that it didn't matter. I don't know. Anyway. Yeah, the knight-type characters, they have a fair amount of HP. But, like, that guy's actually faster than Sociant. But other than that, like, these guys really aren't that dangerous. Even that mage isn't very dangerous. He only usually only attacks, like, once. So, compared to, like, every other mage we've met so far. Yeah, there's not really any divul uh, diverging paths or much of anything to this, so... I think... Aren't you... He might be. Let's use a tent just in case. Oh yeah, I wouldn't use dragon abilities, by the way, just because Atrucian's HP will drop to practically nothing, so... Yep, this is a demon box. Yeah, these guys are around, but they're a bit easier than they were before. I mean, unless there's a whole ton of them. Oh, wow, there's a whole ton of them. We'll see how well this goes. I may have to defend... Well, actually, I don't care. I have all those uh, feathers of raw, or whatever they be called, raw's feather. Yo, Barna! Killed two of them, man! All right! Actually, hop them... Well, no, he won't be able to kill two of them. Can't even kill one of them. Wait! No, Sociat! No! <laughs> kill the one that's already damaged! There we go. Now you can go up to the other guy. Ooh, ouch. I guess I can't defend. I forgot my agil I don't have the uh, agility boost anymore, so I'm slower than these guys now. It should be fine, though, for the most part. Ooh. I hope. Don't kill Farna! Yeah, it's... Oh, wow. Now, which one were, was Sochian attacking? Also, let's go ahead and heal everyone, since I have all these heal gens. Or the game could just pause on me again. Why not? Sheesh. I'm surprised I didn't go for attrition at all. Yeah, this way, Tamara won't have to waste any points healing. Maybe she'll do something useful. Hmm. Yeah, let's defend. Oh, that's useful. Thanks. Um, you're, you're good, Tamron. I I'm safe. Could have done that for someone else, maybe, but... Yeah, unfortunately, attrition kind of sucks. <laughs> also. <laughs> Especially compared to Barna. Good grief! Is she good? Well, that wasn't as dangerous as uh, it could have been. 500 experience points each! So, probably gonna get a couple, well, not a couple levels, but Jushin and Tamron both should level up at least once from this, so... There you go! No, well, this is useful at least. I do like that little guy, even though he's not terribly strong, but... 4,000 experience points. Level ups for both of us, alright. Getting closer to 64, so that Tamron will finally be able to heal fully. Let's see... Actually, isn't this one a... De oh, no, it's not. Yeah, I'm thinking of a little above here. We get a Warmal's Medicine, which is up here for some reason. I don't know how he got it up here, but... I don't know, maybe he's secretly a Horus or something. I don't know. Another de- Oh, I should have healed first. Well, we should be fine. Nice. Seven of them. And, uh, Tamron got... Level up. Well, I guess maybe those soldiers are a little bit more dangerous than I thought. Just one guy did that to Hothram, and he had full HP. Uh, well, I guess I don't need... Yeah, I guess I didn't need healing back there, but... I was looking to heal Jen, I guess. Not that, you know... <laughs> it's not that big a deal, so... Anyway, let's see. Are you a demon box? You might be. Maybe I should save or something more. I don't know, but... Oh, yeah, one level up back there, you know, that I got from the, the first set of demon boxes, and attrition is faster than them now, so awesome. He already got another level up, so I'm not even sure what his speed specifically was, but... Yeah, roughly 130 is what you need to be faster than them, so... Oh, high potion? Not that it really matters that much. Let's see... 
good enough. Three of them, not even a concern. I guess I... Let's see, what was I saying about going a different path, but I want to... Uh, get those demon boxes for the last little bit of experience points. Yeah, Tamron's one level away from me being able to heal full HP, so... Let's get that level up, shall we? Okay, not quite yet. Anyway. I hate the fact that... By virtue of Attrition's high-cost weapon, he kind of ends up sucking. I mean, it costs eight, right? We get a diamond for no good reason. Yeah, we don't need money, so... But yeah, it costs eight, right? And his points max out at 40. So he can only do... Five points at max, or five hits <laughs> uh, at max. So even if he does have really, really high attack power and all, it doesn't really amount to all that much <laughs> compared to, say, Hothram or uh, Farna. Let's see. I believe the yeah left is a dead end. So yeah, we want to go. That's why did you heal yourself? Oh, it heals everyone? Wow, I didn't know you could do that. Huh, what do you know? Stupid soldiers. This guy and the green guy teamed up on Farna and killed her so that we ended up using the one of those raw feathers. <sighs> oh well, it's not that big a deal. So I guess the monsters around here are a little bit more confident than I'm giving them credit for, but still, it's like, pfft, whatever. Almost there, Tamron. Almost there. Yep, can't go to the left. Just checking, of course. Let's see, in that treasure chest there. Kind of a good one. Get the magic hood. Finally, another uh, piece of headgear for Tamron, the ultimate one. Uh, oop, no, I would rather look at it first. Yeah, if you didn't have uh, or get the bunny hat, she would still be rocking that freaking bandana that we got in the first flipping dungeon, the weakest helmet in the game. Not that this one's like, you know, that big a deal, but well, it's something, <laughs> I guess. Anyway. Alright, now Tam is at level 64, so... She probably should have max points now as well, right? Oh, 24. I thought she maxed at 23. Guess maybe it was 24 then. Or natural point, but whatever. Anyway, she basically is at her, you know, as best as she's going to ever be. More or less, so... Level up for attrition. I don't believe there's anything over there, right? We just go out. Oh, I guess it... Anyway. Raw's Feather replaces the one I lost, I guess. That's the third out of three, so... Uh... What the heck was that?! I've never seen you do that before! What the heck was that?! Dude! You actually have another competent spell? You gotta be kidding! <laughs> huh! That was a new one! <laughs> oh, I, wait. Yeah, this is the right way. Hmm, it got kind of turned around back there. Oh, yeah, I totally got turned around. Wait, did I? Wait a minute. I don't need to go this way, right? Oh, yeah, I did miss something. Okay, there we go. 100 Paris! Useless as it is. Okay, yay. Oh, God, you got your useless spell now? Oh. Yeah, agility down to all monsters. But as you can see, it never does more than five, and actually sometimes does less, so it's almost completely useless, except, like, for, like, one instance where it, like, it made one enemy slower than, like, attrition or something, and it's like, okay, I guess that's useful. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> oh, well. Let's 
see. Yeah, I want to go this way. Kind of an important chest here. Wait. Oh! Ah, well, that was stupid. I totally missed something back there. Ay, uh, yeah, yeah. Anyway. Jeez. Anyway. Come on, there's a chest clearly right there. So. Oh. Isn't it? Oh, yeah, there we go. I just... Anyway, kind of... One step away, huh? <laughs> From getting the Sagittary Pad, or Sagittarius Pad, the ultimate body armor for Socian, and good grief is it good. Where is it? Because it increases his points by freaking 30! <laughs> Among other things there, so... Yeah, he actually breaks the, well, what, the uh, the uh, apparent limit on, uh, or the graphical <laughs> limit on points there, up to 49, so, well, I guess you could have given him those other points, it would have given him one more slightly better, or, you know, slightly strong attack, <laughs> but anyway, yeah, he's basically as strong as he's gonna get now, so, I can't believe I walked right by that. Oh yeah, he has a dip in agility now. I don't... He's not faster than Hawthorne, is he? No, 157. So yeah, not not even close. But yeah, he's never gonna... <laughs> he was almost on top of his other speed, but... Anyway, let's get back around to where I got that tent, shall we? It's too bad we get the... the, uh, Sagittary pad so freaking late. <laughs> Oh, wait, 47? I could totally just grind out that last little bit there, because we're here! At the final... well, door. <laughs> so yeah, use that tent we just got, even though I have more than I'll ever need anyway, and, uh... Yeah, I guess I'll might as well grind out that last little level, even though I could just cheat. <laughs> Which, uh, we'll show you that, uh, briefly, as well as the final boss on the finale of Let's Play Emerald Dragon. Arrivederci.